Hi guys, Jessica here from the Healing Hands Duo. We've been working on something very, very big, so you're gonna get to get see the great reveal of actually converting over our little spa-like retreat area that we will be having people in here hopefully by October. So I'm gonna do a little bit before, and then I'll show you the after, and then I will kind of go over what we'll have available out of this space. Our home-based studio is a low toxin and energy haven for those looking to escape a noisy world of sound, light, and non-native EMF pollution. We have spent tens of thousands of dollars to protect our studio from Wi-Fi technology, toxic building materials, cleaning products, LED lighting in the blue spectrum, dirty electricity, and etc. We have also spent countless hours trying our best to create a physically and emotionally grounding atmosphere. With grounding pads where applicable, implementing a well thought out space using soothing and calming colors and decor, as well as the principles that we've learned within Vastu Shastra. With our premium packages and for your convenience, you will also be provided with several clean towels, a bathrobe, a complimentary shower facility, high quality filtered structured water, soothing music, and several supplements with each of your sauna sessions to make your experience as comfortable and tranquil as possible. Welcome to the Healing Hands Duo Energy Balancing Light Studio, where all of our guests are treated like family. Hi guys, this is Jessica and Kevin from the Healing Hands Duo, and I know you guys haven't seen us in a very long time, but as you can see, we're in a new space. Um, we have been working very diligently around the clock to try and get this place set up. Um, we have decided to go ahead and open up our own business where we will be running a studio out of our home. This is our new studio space to film our videos. But we will also be inviting people into our home to use the various different machines that you would have seen in the first part of this video. So as you have noticed, we finally um, bit the bullet and actually purchased our very own Photon Genius. Probably about four to five years we had been, uh, we were owners already of the Photon Genie, the smaller machine, as well as a Qi machine and a um, medical grade sauna, which Kevin converted over, there's the Photon Genie, um, and a medical grade sauna, which was the sauna ray that we converted over actually to a red light and near infrared as well. We're gonna probably have to do independent videos on each of those machines individually because there's probably a lot of information to cover there. However, I will link down below and possibly on the screen somewhere where there has been some testimonials on some of these machines as well as people who actually have had really great explanations as, as to how the machines in fact work. 
Um, however, I wanted to let you guys know, because I know you guys haven't seen us for almost four to five months now. We are going to be finishing off Kevin's last video to the diet video, hopefully this coming January. But we did just want to go through a few of the things that we've been up to in the last five months. So as you can see here in the first half of this video, we've done this in full renovation conversion, which did take us a lot longer than we had suspected. It was, it's not a very large space, but I tried my best to make it as comfortable as possible to invite people into our home. And of course, with Kevin's expertise and having um, some courses on, of course, he's an electrical engineer, but he's also done a lot of courses on EMF remediation and whatnot. So I'm going to let him talk about a little bit of what, about what we did here and how we've safeguarded this home. It hasn't just been the last five months. We've been doing this probably for the last six or seven years. So this is also a quiet zone is what we like to call it. Low on EMFs, the machines as well don't give off any non-native EMF either. So maybe you want to just touch base on some of the things that we've done here. Yeah, we've uh, carefully kind of selected all the materials that has, you know, we put into this basement here too. Not just, you know, the electrical and everything else like that. It's, you know, the materials like the, the flooring and, um, you know, the materials in the bathroom, you know, the materials on the walls, all of it, uh, even the insulation has all been kind of yeah. carefully selected to try and find something that, uh, you know, is doesn't give off as, as, as much toxins and you know, off -gassing, environmentally BOCs, friendly, yes. these types all of things. So, We're very big on all that too. So Yeah, so everything in here has been kind of carefully selected in that sense. Um, the electrical here, we've, uh, at least I have, I've really kind of gone a little extra, extra mile to make sure that it is kind of an EMF friendly zone down here. So everything from all the pot lights in here. I made sure we did not uh, put any LEDs in here. I'm not a big fan of LEDs. They give off too much dirty electricity. These are all kind of old school halogens. Uh, I got a little bit of grief when we decided to put these up because they do <laughs> take a lot more space up in the ceiling. So we had to prepare for that. And of course, look, well, you know, the, most people are going to LEDs. I think everybody has LEDs in their home now. And anybody that goes and chooses old school, you know, pot lights like I did, like the halogen type, they, you know, Everybody kind of thought I was crazy. So, but there's a reason for that. Color temperature is kind of a you know a very warmer temperature. I kind of wanted to make sure that we didn't emit all kinds of you know toxic blue light. So it's kind of very soothing down here. So the lighting aspect was a big one. Um, all the wiring, of course, all the wiring in this basement was. I made sure that we put in uh, kind of a BX type of cabling down here to make sure it's all shielded. So. Pretty much all the wiring that's been done down here gives off no electric fields at all. Everything from all the lights, receptacles, even our sauna, everything has all been done with this special wire that we had the uh, electrician put in for us. We did have to upgrade our electrical panel as well to kind of accommodate for all the new things that we're putting in down here. You know, the capacity wasn't there, so we had to put a new electrical panel in there. So that was all kind of carefully and all the breakers that we put in there, I made sure we put the right types of breakers in there too. From an EMF point of view, there really isn't much going on down here at all. All the electrical fields have been kind of dampened down. Of course, there's no wireless going on here at all. There's no wireless in our home period. Yes, and so, that's another thing that I, I, I wanted to mention. It's actually one thing. You can't even get a cell phone signal down here. Yeah, it's like really that. hard so. to get a cell phone <laughs> signal in our home because we did go wireless. I mean, we did decide to um, not use wireless technology in our home probably about four years ago. Yep. Um, Kevin and I will make an entire video on EMFs and dirty electricity and all that as well. We haven't touched any of that on our YouTube channel yet, but that's something that we're both very, very strong yep. um, believers in, as well as even the Photon Genius. The idea and the premise of that working on light and energy to heal the body is something that we're huge advocates for, especially because this is something that we use to regain our health. The other thing with that I just wanted to make mention, it's not just the studio space but it is our entire home and we had to go through miles to actually create a very non-toxic environment a bit of our course. house has been carbon painted some of the walls that were uh, getting we were getting some of the wireless uh, signals let me talk about the things that you've yeah well most of the electronics in this home have actually taken apart most of them kind of rewired them in a bit so that uh, they don't emit as much you know the electrical fields and all these other things so i've done some little tweaking there and most of the dirty electricity components that we have plugged into the wall, I've kind of mitigated that. We've done some dirty electricity filtering and things like that in this house here too. Of course, there's no wireless 
all the internet and all of our smart TVs, they're all plugged in to the wall. So I've ran Cat6 cabling, all network cabling to pretty much every room in this house. Which so it's all hardwired. Every, okay, so it's hardwired. It's hardwired. So, so we got all, is... all, I ran all Cat6 double shielded cabling all throughout this home, all on a main network switch. So we can, everything's plugged in. For my laptop, we have two smart TVs down here. They're all plugged in, so there's no wireless going on. And, um, yeah, so, and, and all the lighting, like I said, too, has been carefully selected. There's no LEDs, no compact fluorescent light bulbs, none of that stuff. And it's kind of old, old school. So it is, you know, from an energy point of view, it does cost a little bit more. But in our, uh, in, at least in my opinion, it, uh, it's, it's worth it. It's you know? a trade-off. It's either your health pay now or, or pay later. You exactly, know? Uh, exactly. And I, I think so. the reason, we've kind of got off topic here. We're supposed to be talking about the studio, but the reason why we wanted to... Uh, brush up on this is because this is something that we truly truly believe in is where the world needs to go next and if you've been following us on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook I've been talking about blue light toxicity quite a bit lately and the reason for that is that there is a lot of research coming out now showing that these non-native EMFs are very damaging to cellular our cellular biology um, it dehydrates our cells it causes cell in some cases inflammation cell death if you are struggling with bacterial or viral or parasitic infections, it apparently makes them flourish. It makes candida flourish. Uh, blue light toxicity screws up your circadian biology, which then lends to poor sleep, and God only knows when you're not sleeping, you're not repairing. So this is something that we take very seriously, and this is one of the reasons why I started off with that. I want people to know that when they're coming here, they're coming to what I like to call a safe zone. So I feel that not only have we brought in very good energy into this studio space, but by selecting, by carefully selecting the lights and the non-toxic materials that went into this, as well as not having any dirty electricity. Again, I'd like to believe that, you know, the design and the concept and the soothing colors and the idea of us using crystals and essential oils and, you know, just having the ambiance to come here and sit and have a few sessions, whether it be in the infrared sauna or the photon genius or the photon genie is something that also adds to that. The other thing is, is we've used these uh, pieces of equipment out of more of a clinical setting and we've never really had, we've never been able to use them out of a setting like this, something that was more relaxed. We want you to invite you into our home and make you feel like you're part of our family. The other thing is, is we've also created a bathroom specifically for our clients. So then that way we are very strong believers in detoxing, but when you are sweating out all these toxins from your body, which is what you'll be doing with the saunas, you want to wash that off because in the sweat, the sweat will be quite toxic. The other thing that, like I said before, we'll probably get into further detail about what the Photon Genius is capable of doing. I've already mentioned some of this on our Facebook that's and a, Instagram. That's, that's, that's going to be a that's video. A, that's a loaded one. So. Yeah, and, and I also really, really want to create a few videos from not only our testimonials, which I already have one on our YouTube channel, but our, my mother and father-in-law, Kevin's parents, have been using this machine for many years as well, and they have a great success story that I'd love to capture on camera as well. However, I don't want to misguide people. Again, it took Kevin and I years to get where we are today, and I like, I'm very proud to say both of us are doing very, very well, having been diagnosed with but Lyme disease, that's not Lyme's, um, and me having been diagnosed with Crohn's colitis, and in Canada, at one point they were saying that Kevin was struggling with MS and I'm very proud to say we are not experienced we're, we're both pretty much symptom free at this point we're not struggling with any of that um, the other thing is that we were kind of MIA on YouTube for various different reasons not only were we working on this but it does take a lot to get something set up like this the other thing is i've been looking into a few different supplements because we intend to carry hemp products because that was something else that was a big part of our recovery using cbd products as well as hemp products both internally and topically uh, we used things like fulvic humic acid liquid zeolites for to help with detoxification and increasing energy as well as vitamin C. So these are something that we also want to bring to our clients and be able to offer out of this space as well. So just, so just one thing to note too, that we're not doctors, so we're not going to you know talk about anything on this level. But um, the idea of what we're doing down here is we want to kind of offer some people some, some, some sessions on 
you know, the very basis of what light and sound can do. And most of the equipment that we have down here is all based on that. And um, as far as the environment goes, we've tried to set this up as, you know, more tranquil and more kind of soothing and, you know, getting into the spiritual side of things kind of gets into the, you know, the five elements and how we brought all of them into this space as well, which, you know, we won't go too much into detail on that. But, and of course, which... we've offered a, a product line that uh, we have tried and tested over the years. Some products that we've used, I've used through my battle with Lyme disease and kind of found that they worked, including other people that have tried them too. So we've, we've kind of carefully selected the best from our experience and we're gonna offer all that. Kind of a new journey. And um, yeah, it kind of starts here. So that's been in the last five months kind of just preparing for this and yes, lots, and of, stuff, it, uh, lots it, of stuff's been going on. And so. it's taken a lot longer. We actually started this back when we, like our YouTube channel was up. I And you know, thank you so much for all of, to all of you who have subscribed to our channel. I know we haven't been uh, kind of live for four to five months, but I still ended up getting over 400 subscribers and I'm so thankful for that. I've also been getting a lot of personal emails um, and a lot of messages from a lot of you guys. And so I do apologize if I don't always get back to you as quickly as I would like to. It's just that I've been really busy, not only setting this up, but talking to distributors, getting my supplements in. Again, there's there's just paperwork that needs to be filled out. The other thing I wanted to talk about is that at some point we do hope to bring in um, mindfulness and meditation into this space. So I've been talking to a friend of mine about that as well because I think a lot of people miss that aspect and a lot of people don't realize that taking care of your mind, body and soul is a big part in recovery from any illness. And um, that often goes overlooked because a lot of people think it's not necessary and it's just not true. I think when we started, like for me, Kevin does a lot of meditation. Uh, he's been very committed to his practice for almost a year now. I've been working very, very closely and I've actually posted about her with my spiritual healer and she's been absolutely a godsend to me. She's a very good friend of mine now. I want to do an entire video just dedicated to her as well because I love her very dearly. And she's helped me and Kevin quite uh, quite a bit, as well as his parents. Um, so we will do that too. The other thing that I wanted to mention is that in this space, we didn't mention the water in our home either. We have taken a lot of steps to ensure that our water is living structured water. So the water that you're going to be getting when you are in the sauna, as well as showering in our home, is completely structured water. But the water that you were going that we were going to be giving people is very um, not only clean, it goes through, I believe, a seven-stage water pure, system pure in, living, our, in our home. Living energetic water. That's yes. kind of a, so, you know, a, a, a staple in this home is that, you know, you're not only going to drink it, you're going to bathe in it as well. So, yeah. you know, as you're getting bathed with light and sound, you're going to drink pure, energized, you know, structured water as well. And um, that's a big part of this as well. Yeah. So. Like, I think it's important to mention that Again, we haven't gotten into all of this on our channel because it, it's just a lot to talk about. But we've been working on this not just for the last five months. We've been working on our home and ourselves for probably, like Kevin and I have known each other for 12 years. We did get sick very soon into our relationship, maybe within the first year or two, and maybe the second year. And the thing is, is once that happened, I don't know what it was about the two of us, but we did try conventional therapies and neither of us were getting anywhere with with it. So we did turn to alternative medicine, um, holistic um, practitioners, naturopathic doctors. Uh, then we even went as far as the you know the natural healers, as well as looking into light, energy, sound. Like we've taken every avenue and tried to put it into the studio space. I think at this point. So it's you're going to be like getting. You said, it's more kind of healing, you know, the body, and the mind, body, and, and soul. And yeah. You're looking at all three concepts, you can't. They're all connected. You can't right. just do one and not the other. So we've spent the majority of the years kind of just experimenting and it's experiencing on on all these things. And you know, what we're getting getting into now is kind of a, a summary of you know our, the results for us and what's worked and kind of sharing it all with you. So yes, and that's, that's pretty, much it. pretty much what we've decided to do here. Again, I'm not going to speak too much about what each of the machines do or what the sessions will cost. Go um, quick overview if you want. We've if well, we could, there. we definitely could do a quick overview if if people needed that. Um, I would like to talk more extensively about what the machines are capable of doing because I think like the Photon Genius deserves a full video to itself. Even the Genie, the smaller awesome. machine. 
So that's the so photon sorry. genius. You would have seen, I will post what that looks like in live uh, video before this. But again, like, so maybe, okay, so let's like, for instance, the Photon Genie, what does the Photon Genie provide? Well, the Photon Genie is this little device here. This was the first device that we bought when I was at my worst with Lyme disease and desperate for any kind of help. We turned to this and we purchased this and we bought it and this had just profound results for me. So yeah, this little guy here is, it's got a lot of power. And so I think it's important it's, to mention that before we even purchased these machines, this wasn't new, new technology to us. Kevin and I for years had been doing ozone treatments. So we had been doing insufflation of ozone through the nose and then through the ears. We, have been, we had been doing Rife for quite a bit of years prior to that. Yeah. I had actually been doing injectable ozone into my legs when I was struggling with edema and lymphatic problems. Yeah. Kevin was getting injectable ozone into his teeth yeah. when he was dealing with all those issues. But this technology kind of consolidates all of that. Yeah, and in so a, you're going to get... Way. So what this device here does is it, it pretty much broadcasts a lot of... It's, it's, it's kind of a light and sound machine, basically. You've got two little energetic packs that are here that you put on various parts of the body, and they just vibrate various frequencies of sound. Mm -hmm. And of course you have the wands here. And none of this is audible, so you won't hear it. It's yeah. just these the sounds are yeah. unfortunate like not unfortunately but they're just not audible. very they're, sacred frequencies yes too. and they're you very can well tested frequencies for yes. you know, the last hundred years there's a lot of research into this and i will post a video specifically to what this machine does however it's not going to look the same because it's the older version of what this one is um but these these sound frequencies too the and i will if people need this I will let you hear it over the phone. You can hear these frequencies. So if you have the machine going, you can hear the frequencies over the line, over, over the telephone lines. So it will screw up the frequency on the phone. So that way you know this frequency is actually being broadcast out of this machine, even though you audibly can't hear it without having a phone or something like that. Yeah, yeah exactly. And of course it's got um, <clears throat> two wands here too that you can put on various parts of the body. And each of the wands here, they're filled with noble gas. So what this does is that it actually charges the noble gas so that it creates a plasma. So that when you put it on the body, it kind of just delivers light into the body. So basically you're just driving all kinds of free electrons into the body. A lot of things get uh, start magically happen when that happens. Uh, you know, so there's a, an ozone gas that gets produced as well once it gets into the bloodstream. So you'll start to smell like ozone. And that's another well. thing. Ozone's a so, natural blood cleanser. Um, as yeah. you all know, the smell, the best way to describe it is the way that the world, I mean, that the, even the earth clean, cleans itself. It's like after a natural, um, like a rainstorm or a thunderstorm, you go outside and yeah. you can smell that fresh air. And that's exactly what ozone smells like because it naturally cleans the air. And it'll do, if you do transdermal ozone or even insufflation of ozone, it does the same thing in the body. It oxygenates the body, but yeah. also, clean, like, it's a blood cleanser. So. Yeah. That's it, another reason why we used this nature's technology. nature's cleaning system. Exactly. So why not deliver something like that into the body? It can have some pretty profound results, and that's exactly what it does. And so. the idea of that as well is that parasitic and bacterial and viral infections don't thrive in a very in a highly oxygenated space, or even, for that matter, like black molds or people who have been exposed to mold toxins and stuff like that. Again, I just want to put it out there. Kevin and I are in no way practitioners or doctors or any of that sort, so we can't make any specific claims to, as to what these machines are capable of doing. And again, if you come here to decide to use them, this is all for in, your own informational purposes and stuff. And I will have to put a disclaimer at the front and probably in the middle and at the end of this video, because again, I don't want to steer anybody in the wrong direction and make you yeah. think that we are practitioners of any sort. Yeah. But to summarize, like I said, it's, there's two little packs here that kind of generate sound, and then there's two wands here that generate, um, it kind of delivers light into the body in a very unique way, using kind of a plasma. And the combination of the both is uh, very, very powerful for healing, um, just about most on, on every level. Mm -hmm. So it's a, great, uh, it's a great unit. It's had uh, great results for, for myself. And uh, even my family as well, you, they use it all the time. And, um, His parents also parents own the same it. machine as yep. well. Um, and the other thing that we did neglect to mention is that when you actually have these wands on you, they emit a small little, I like to call it a zap, but it is a little electrical current that you can physically feel. Sure. And that kind of works off of the premise, to my understanding, like the Do Dr. Fulda Clark zapper. So again, something to help with, uh, you know, kind of fighting off parasites, bacteria, and, and things like that. So sure. that's what the smaller machine does. However, 
the, we used this for four or five years and it, this was amazing and I, I do want to also pre-warn people because I've had a few people here to use the machine already and they have left feeling not necessarily the greatest or a little bit worse and I do need people to understand that there is always going to be a detoxifying reaction that you're going to get from introducing these types of frequencies to the body. So one thing to note about this here too is that you know it is a powerful little unit so anybody with kind of a heavy pathogenic load like people with Lyme disease or any other type of you know autoimmune or any of these types of conditions this does stimulate all that this will take care of a lot of that but the yeah. one thing that you know at least in my experience is that you know as this thing starts to you know all these parasites and all these other you know viral and you know um, bacterial types of things that we're dealing with start to die off you know, your body kind of has to deal with a lot of the waste products and a lot of the debris that's left behind. It gets trapped and, you know, it's, it's, it, your lymphatic system becomes a, you need to really take care of that. And this here I found did a very good job of kind of taking care of some of the pathogenic load that I was dealing with, but it didn't do enough to kind of get my lymphatic system going enough to kind of clear out a lot of that garbage that was left over, mm -hmm. right? So I really right. struggled with some of that. My lymphatic system was just getting so plugged up. Yeah, mine and too, and that's why I developed edema. My legs actually got to almost double or triple the size at yeah. some point till the point where I couldn't even walk. And, and that's, that's kind of what led us to the infrared sauna. Sorry. Yes. That's kind of what led us to the infrared sauna. So we purchased the infrared sauna, which is our sauna ray unit. Uh, it's an infrared, uh, a far infrared unit. So we purchased that just for this reason. I was really struggling with my lymphatic system and I wanted to get some of that moving. So we bought the sauna and I started some deep sweating and that really did help. It was big, 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 big changes for me. But so, I want to mention with the sauna, I found it was helpful too, but there were times where I was really, really, really struggling with different hormonal stuff as well as adrenal fatigue. And I found that I couldn't temp my, my temperature, I couldn't regulate my temperature. So I was getting extreme flushing um, and I was getting sweats at night because of the babesia and stuff like that so I found it sometimes very uncomfortable to get into a sauna per se because of the enclosed space and the heat so that was something that I was struggling with but Kevin was using it very diligently but it used to make me feel a little oh, yeah. bit more sick so it made me feel better some of the stuff just started kind of coming out and started moving and it was it was it was good so that was the, the, the two together with kind of the Photon Genie and the Infrared Sauna was a big uh, kind of dynamic duo I found that uh, worked quite well for us. Yeah. And then that kind of leads to the third unit that we have here now which is the Photon Genius and this is kind of the, I don't know, what will we call it? Well actually <laughs> before that what happened was we were using the other two machines and I found it wasn't, they weren't doing the greatest job at draining the lymph. They were doing a lot of great things for what to me seemed like we were killing a lot of things, we were getting a lot of things to move, we were doing the ozone, we were doing all that stuff. But like I said, our both of our systems, even though we were we had purchased a, a sauna, we weren't draining the lymph quick enough. And again, anybody that understands Lyme disease and all of its co-infections, there is a lot that can be released. So unfortunately, we were both having quite a bit of problems with our lymphatic system. We were literally getting swollen glands in through the throat. I was getting swollen glands through my breasts, um, and in through the groin. Kevin had literally gotten such a swollen gland that it basically almost created his hernia, or to a certain extent, that's along with some of his dental stuff and infection. The hernia started to pop out a little bit more. Um, so then we actually bought a chi machine, which we'll be offering the chi machine here too. But then again, that's a small little unit that people will be able to use. And that was to basically create chi throughout the body. And I had actually purchased that thinking that I'd be able to move the lymph. Again, some people have great results with the chi machine, but it still was just not enough for us. Yeah. We needed something stronger than that. Yeah, and that's kind of where this purchase came in and that's kind of... The whole reason why we're doing this basement now, we kind of fit this into some of the other devices we just talked about, and now we're going to be offering sessions on this. And this kind of incorporates the Photon Genie, the infrared sauna, along with so many other things that are on top of it that this machine can do, and it's just a, it's a powerhouse. Yes. No question. As far as, you know, moving the lymph and everything else that these machines can do, I, this thing really is, uh, you know, a wonderful thing.
to help help with that. And I think one of the, the greatest things for me personally about the Photon Genius was that the detox reaction, although for some we had been doing this stuff for years, but although for some it might be more extensive, but for me that was the first time that I didn't get a huge detox reaction. If anything, I just had things starting to clear up for me for the first time. And I started to develop more energy and some of my nausea went away. At the time I had used this machine out in Michigan and Kevin had actually flown out to use it in BC. Um, it cleared up his skin in a week. And again, I don't want people to be misguided by that. Kevin did 20 over 20 sessions in one week in order to clear up his skin. And I had done four to five sessions to start getting my bowels to function properly again. But I got lucky again, cause I was able to use our smaller counter, the smaller counterpart at home too. So again, I don't want people to think you're gonna come here and use the machine two to three times and it's gonna be the end all be all. Yeah. And again, this is this type of technology. People need to understand that nutrition is important. Cleaning up your environment is important, which means using toxic chemicals in your house is gonna make you more sensitive. Building materials that are toxic is gonna to make you more sensitive. You know, being surrounded by Wi-Fi technology, that these things are all gonna be adding a burden to the immune system and the things that the immune system will have to concentrate on. So the more you can do up front that way, like you know, cleaning up your environment and eating better, and that means eating organic, using some supplements but again I have now become an affiliate for Touchstone Essentials because I really truly believe in what they are doing I worked within the industry for eight years but the one thing I'm not very fond of is synthetic isolates and distillates of whether it be from hemp products or even from vitamins and minerals and, and supplements because I think you need the whole food source so that's why I've decided to become an affiliate for Touchstone Essentials they do offer a great line of whole foods supplements so we will be offering that and of course uh, hemp products and CBD products and stuff like that and again you'll have to go to a doctor for medicinal marijuana and stuff like that that was a big part to our healing process as well um, so that's something that you know maybe we can talk to people about when they come here there's a lot to go over and we will go over each of these things individually as we have more time to sit down and do extensive videos maybe do some write-ups we decided to do this very like openly today without a script because i just really wanted to talk from the heart today uh the other thing is is the reason why this took so long is because we've had a lot of obstacles that have come up in our way but anything that kevin and i have ever done in our life has always not necessarily come very easy to us and i think that that was not only half the battle but that's what's made it, that's why we have such an intense drive because things were never never really came easy and i felt like you know spirit or the universe was really testing us in order to make us stronger as not only a couple but as people individually and and you know be stronger to help other people in the last five months we've just had some strange things that have come up i don't know do you want to touch base on some of that well, stuff and been tough times for everybody this year i think anybody that's gonna watch this is probably gonna say yeah it's been one hell of a year and i think you know we're not any different you know you know we're, we've been through some tough times you know getting this renovation done hasn't been easy there's a lot of tough times we went through there and finally we got to the end of it and even myself personally you know i lost my job about a month ago of 12 years you know i was an electrical engineering kind of manager and um yeah that kind of ended quite uh, dramatically over uh, about a month ago. So I've been kind of, you know, recuperating from that, not so much, but it's kind of, it's been good for me to kind of realize that, you know, I'm, there's more opportunities for me now. Yeah. You know, I'm And what people need to understand is that I lost my job well, almost three, well, three, years years ago, ago, yeah. three years ago now. So and two of us lost our jobs. So we're so. both out of work right now. So that's why we are, putting our heart and our soul and tears and sweat into making this work. The yeah, idea is this is where our passion is. And to help others. And we know people others, are struggling. Yes. We struggled and we found ways to kind of cope and deal and we want to kind of give some of these, you know, some of these things back. That's yeah. pretty much what it is. And the things that have worked, we're going to offer that to everybody. Yeah. I think another thing that was important to mention was that even, you know, I've, we've looked around and we've been talking to a lot of people and a lot of people seem to be going through really tough times. Now for the first time, our, our health is great and we're not struggling with that, but I, I, I'm noticing it's been a common thing amongst friends and family. A lot of people are going through a lot of sadness, a lot of depression, and I think the energy 
is very different this year and I think it's going to continue into 2019 and that's something Definitely. to be um, weary of and you know we want to let people know that we're there for you if you need to reach out and uh, you know you're feeling lonely and you want to send us an email again we'll try and get back to you guys as soon as possible but that's something I want to let people know that you're not alone there's a lot of people going through this a lot of mental illness is coming up right now a lot of depression a lot of anxiety even two Things months ago on every level yeah. I think you can see it out if you're paying attention enough everything is changing on every level yeah I don't think this is going to change so hanging on to the past is one big thing that we really need to look at yeah because the more you hang on to it the more i think this could really you know cause some discomfort for you right and so, it was even like kevin and i about um two months ago it was actually halloween night and i had mentioned this on our instagram and our facebook because if you guys haven't or if you're not following us there please follow us there too because i do regular posts there as well it's just easier for me to do written posts there kevin will be doing some more written posts there now that he's not um, going into the office every day either uh, the other thing is is about two two months ago we were ready to kind of launch a lot of this stuff back in october and then kevin and i had gone out because we hadn't been out in a very long time and we decided to go out for halloween with a bunch of friends and go to like a haunted house thing in toronto and that night we ended up coming across a major car accident where a young boy, three years old, lost his life and his mother. And we've kind of been in an ongoing, um, kind of involved with an ongoing investigation with that for a couple weeks after it. And it was, I'm not going to lie, it was very difficult for me to deal with it just because we were the first ones that arrived on the scene and having to see that was difficult. And it just made us think about life. A little bit differently even though we've been thinking about life a lot but just how precious life is and how you really do need to cherish every moment and then I kind of had put everything on hold for the next like three to four weeks while we were kind of recuperating from that and um, I do apologize yeah. I have other companies that have reached out to us too and that's something else I want to talk about in the next couple of weeks I'm gonna be doing some product reviews because I've had companies reaching out and sending me products um, free products in order to review them and there's been two companies that have recently sent me stuff and I really love their products so I really need to get those videos out I just haven't had the chance just with Kevin losing his job the renovation getting this studio going distributors dealing with the police and and all that so but we're at the end of that yeah so now we can start a new phase which is 2019 right around the right time you know yeah. the end of the year is coming you know we got a December 22nd, I guess, kind of this new, you know, full moon coming to kind of, you know, start a new beginning here. So, and then 2019 is right around the corner. So, yeah, it's good. It's yes. nice. Start fresh. You know, we've yeah. been through some, some hell and back, you know, losing my job, Jesse losing her job. And... and this is something that scares the crap out of me. I'm not going to lie. It scares me, but it's something I'm really ready for. I think, you know, we're almost yeah. 40 years old and we've been wanting this yeah. for a very long time. Mm -hmm. and... For both of us, we're done kind of, you know taking from the world and now we want to give give back yeah you know, in, Absolutely. A, in a way that can really help people yeah really people are struggling and I think we have a lot to, to offer people so yeah and again it's what we're doing here again is not about us either it's about you guys and even giving you guys access to these types of equipment as well as these supplements and this environment again this is only going to be half of it the other half is going to be you guys and your mentality and your belief in getting better and that's something that I really strongly advocate as well because in order to get better you need to really believe that you're going to get better and that's another thing I hear a lot of people who are like you know what's the point like I'm sick and like I'm this is never going to get better or you know very negative self-talk and very negative about life and and all these things and I've talked about this before and if you really even if you do something and you go in it and in, go into that specific thing very skeptical like oh I'm going to use this machine or I'm going to use this supplement what and it's not going to do anything for me then most likely it's not going to do much for you because you've already convinced yourself that it's not going to do anything for you and I really do believe in mind over matter there's a lot of research out there right now talking about how meditation changes the mind and changes neural pathways because of the you know getting rid of old belief systems and how it, it changes the gray matter on the brain so again these are all things that you need to work towards we can only give you guys this part of it and the rest of it has to really come from you guys the other thing that I wanted to talk about is that 
Again, this is all new for us. So at this point, we're just really looking for your feedback. It really is helpful when you guys subscribe to the channel as well as follow us on our other social media because it puts us into the algorithms and more people are able to see this stuff. So that's all I really wanted to say. And this is gonna be a learning curve for us. So as we get this going, or we wanna work with two people in the month of January, January pro bono, I have mentioned a kind of an application process that we've put out there for that and we think we might have one person in particular that we might work with in January already however that's not set in concrete yet uh, but if you want to find out more about that we are going to be offering the sessions with the equipment that we have as well as supplements and again this would be all free of charge to you in return all that we would ask for is your honest opinion about what how we did and of course this is what we're really looking for it is a testimonial written both written as well as a video testimonial for our social media sites that's all we have for today bye bye, bye.